Oh, okay, where do I start with this? I suppose I should explain why this is just audio. I have been cleaning up my room and I put my camera away and I don't want to bother fishing it out to record this, but this is a very important video. After 10 years of this channel, I have come to the conclusion that I no longer want to pursue YouTube professionally. I still want to make videos. I still want to make people laugh. But it's not going to come at the expense of other things. Namely, my desire to design and develop video games. That is what I went to school for. That is what I put myself $50,000 in debt for. And that is what I have spent the last five years digging myself out of the hole for. And this isn't a decision that I made lightly. It's something that I've been thinking about pretty much since the start of the year. And at the start of the year, I said to myself, I am going to give it one more year. I am going to put a video out every week on Monday. And if it doesn't go anywhere, I'm pulling the plug. But with recent news and just the way YouTube refuses to cooperate with small time video makers, I can't put the effort toward putting so much work into these things if I'm not going to get anything out of it. This is going to stop being a potential vocation. This, from now on, will simply be a hobby. And that means I will not be putting up videos every week. I may not put up videos each month. I will create a video when I have an idea for it. When I have the time to put into one, I will work on it. When I have fun doing it, I will work on it. But I am not going to put my life on hold just for this channel. That isn't healthy. There have been times when I have avoided hanging out with friends just to capture footage for a game review that I want to do. I have spent money on bad games, specifically with the intent of reviewing them on my channel. I have played games that I have absolutely hated. Games that I should have given up on a long time ago, just because I wanted to eventually talk about it. And you may call that devotion, you may call that being a professional, but some may call that psychosis, some may call that delusion. At this point, this channel is not going to make me into the next big YouTube star. It's just not going to happen, not the way YouTube is working, not the way YouTube has their method of just, hey, you uploaded a video, we're not going to tell anybody. I don't want to have to beg people to please click the, click the subscribe button, click the bell to make sure you're notified, or and make sure you watch my other videos, because if you don't watch videos that are of a certain type, you're not going to get notified when the next one goes up. I don't know how anybody is supposed to do this without being a complete and total sellout whore. And major respect to anybody who can keep doing this in the face of absolutely no motivation on the part of the website. So I would like to thank everybody for your support over the last 10 years that this channel has been running. I'm not taking anything down. I am leaving it all up. And 
I am going to keep going. I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing in my own life. I have all kinds of other things I want to do other than just make shitty 20 minute videos, five minute videos talking about bad games. There's more out there. I could do scripted comedy. I want to do like a full scripted series that isn't a riff, isn't a review. It might be a parody, but it's not directly taking content from other people. I want to do something that can't be flagged as fair use because it is something completely original. Whether that fails or succeeds, again, is up to YouTube. But hopefully by the time I come back and I'm ready to do something like that, they'll have fixed their shit. Maybe I'll start a new channel for it. I don't know. But at this point, I know I don't want to continue pursuing YouTube as a professional career. Because if I'm going to work for something... I want it to be something that I really feel strongly about. And at this point, I can't feel strongly about YouTube because they don't feel strongly about small-time video creators. The time to strike should have been five years ago. I admit that. I admit I missed my chance. I missed my chance several times. I should have been there during Screw Attacks by Vids Don't Suck contest. I was doing Video Game Bunker right at the time. I could have done something with that. I should have been there as soon as that guy with the glasses launched. Back before they were Channel Awesome. Back before this whole change the channel debate. But I missed my chance. And I accept that now. But the key is... I can't just keep chasing the same rabbit when there's a perfectly good rabbit that has been waiting for me this whole time. I went to school to make video games, and that's what I'm going to do. I will continue to make videos. They will not be as frequent, but they should still be entertaining. Thank you, everybody, for your support, and happy gaming.